how to upgrade to Windows 11 for free. So first thing you have to do is check if your operating system is capable of upgrading. So you have to check if you have the requirements. Go to the start menu and type in PC health and choose PC health check. And basically you do need a TPM of 2.0 support. Uh, you need secure boot enabled in the BIOS and a supported processor model. So you can uh, go ahead and select check now and it should tell you here if your PC does meet the Windows 11 requirements for you to upgrade or not. So it will scan your computer and see the specs of your computer and let you know whether it is it does meet the requirements to download uh, Windows 11 or not. All right, so if it is good to go, you can go ahead and exit out. And I'll show you three ways on how to upgrade. So first thing you can do is choose the start menu, go to settings, and all you have to do is select Windows Update. And you have to select check for updates. And if you are capable, if your computer is capable of upgrading, it has all the requirements, then it will give you that update on here. And you can simply just continue on and uh, upgrade to Windows 11 operating system. However, if it did not show you on here, there's another way to upgrade your Windows 11. So what you can do is just close this out, open up the internet, you need to go to this link. So I'll be putting that link in the description below. And what you need to do is under Windows 11 installation assistant, all you have to do is select download now. It will download. So you need to run this file. So PS to allow changes. And all you have to do is follow the on-screen prompt to continue with the Windows 11 installation. And this is very safe because it is from the original Microsoft website. Now, it won't let me continue on because I already have Windows 11 on my device. And once you are done, you can simply just reboot your computer and everything should be good to go. It should finish setting up and uh, installing your Windows 11. So the next thing you can do if that option doesn't work is all you have to do is use a USB flash drive. You would need at least eight gigabytes. So once you have eight gigabyte flash drive, connect it to your computer and you can select under create Windows 11 installation media, go ahead and select download now. And you can use this to download that software and select the to continue and it will download, continue with the on-screen prompt and all you have to do is simply just and put it on to your flash drive on your computer. So in my case, I have USB drive D. Choose accept. I'll go ahead and select next. And as you can see, uh, it'll ask you which media you want to use. So. I'll be using a USB flash drive and make sure it has at least a gig 8 gigabytes free. Choose next and you can select a flash drive and select next. Now that will download Windows 11 directly to your flash drive so you can have it on your USB and install it onto any computer and have it handy. So just wait for it to download. It shouldn't take more than an hour and you should be good to go. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Make sure to like, subscribe if you haven't done so, and comment if you have any questions. Thanks.